I'm Laura Jane reporting live for No Good For Me TV. I am at Shoe Market on North 6th Street in Williamsburg, Brooklyn, and I've kidnapped an employee and now I'm going to ask him the five No Good For Me, Too Good For You interview questions. So I'm Laura Jane. I'm James. Sorry, sorry, what's your name? James. This is James. All right, your first question is, if you could describe your personal fashion concept in one sentence or less, what would it be? I really don't, I don't have a concept at all. But that's okay. You, you can explain your non-concept. My non-concept? I mean, I just wear what's comfortable. Um, Weather appropriate. If it's hot, I wear, you know, stuff that won't make me feel hot. If it's cold, <laughs> then I wear a sweater. I don't know, you know. I think I don't try to like follow any trend or anything like that. So. That's great. Function, function over fa fashion. That's James's motto. Okay, number two. Thank you. <laughs> You're welcome. <laughs> That's his answer. Um, who is your number one all-time music crush? Music like a crush for real? Yeah. Probably Damon from Blur. That's a good answer. That's. That's my new answer. Or maybe maybe Alex James. Oh yeah, he's good. Yeah, he's hot. Um, there's others too, but you know, that's... That's the one. For years, I was like, oh shit. Yeah, I know, it's, it's pretty intense, that. Okay, <laughs> uh, number three is, if you could only eat one food for the rest of your life, what would it be? Sushi. Describe the sushi. It would be spicy salmon sushi. Excellent. And miso soup, probably too. Miso. Miso soup and spicy salmon roll. With like the crunchy tempura. Oh yeah, that's yes. great choice. Great choice. Okay, who is your favorite member of the Beatles and why? Oh wow. I mean, well, I love all of them, but I always have a soft spot for Ringo, just because. I mean. Pretty adorable. Even though he couldn't like play as well as the rest of them, he's still like the cool. He's really grateful to be in the band. Yeah, I always had a little crush on him too. But, you know. I kind of don't have a crush on Ringo. Well, like a yeah, you know what I mean. It's yeah, a yeah, totally. No, like a brotherly all. crush. He's just like he's not the least talented, but I don't know for some reason like it makes me like him more. But. I understand, and like you know, you're answering these questions like. Not a lot of people say Ringo. It's like yeah, I mean, I, I mean, I could have been. Like, you're standing up, John. Like he's like the most amazing song. <laughs> oh my god! But no, Ringo has the biggest nose, and we all love him. He's some like really awesome sunglasses and stuff. So. Yeah, he's he's Ringo from I the want Beatles. Be Ringo pretty badly. Excellent. Good luck. And your last question is, what's your spirit animal? My spirit animal. Oh my god. Jellyfish. Whoa, that's really I've cool. I've been doing some really, really gnarly jellyfish the past few days at the beach, so I feel like they could, I don't they know, like if I could take some in. of their like poisonous tentacles, I could like go further. Yeah, and they're they're really psychedelic as far as nature's. Oh, yeah, they're ones too. yeah. So, a phosphorescent yeah. jellyfish. Okay, that would be my spirit. Perfect, great spirit, animal, James. Good to meet you.